have a quick, hopefully quickish review for you guys today. This is the NYX Sugar Trip Squad Shadow Palette. So this was from their holiday stuff. It's currently mid-January and the last time I was on their website they had this on clearance for half off. So, um, I don't know if I would do the full price for it, but I would definitely recommend it at the half price. So this is what it looks like on the inside. And I figured, especially being a holiday palette, it wouldn't have that much pigmentation. But it's got really good pigmentation. Um, it's not, like, you could definitely get more pigmentation if you put a white base underneath. But even without a white base, I got great pigmentation. This I had eye primer on. I did use just um, regular Wet n Wild eye primer. And the blues didn't stain. I have these two on my lids today. The blue didn't stain my lids. This green is really pretty. I mean, this pink is just very potent. This is a very pigmented palette. Um, it is... You've got 12 shades. And... Five of those... Are pressed pigments. And the rest are eyeshadows. Um... As you can see, it's like a cardboard and plastic. Um, but overall, it's I mostly got it because of the theme. And I think it's a really good palette. Um, like I said, they're really pigmented. You could get even more pigmentation with... Hi, Layla. With a um, white base underneath. But... I would definitely recommend this one. The pans are pretty good size too, I think. I mean, there's my finger for comparison. I don't really have a ton to say. I try and keep my reviews short and sweet. But, um, it has 12 shades, 0 0.08 ounces, or 2.3 grams a piece. So, yeah. It does say on the back you're not supposed to use the pressed pigments on your eyes. They're supposed to be for your face. But when you put it in a shadow palette, what do you expect us to do? Everybody's going to put this stuff on their eyes. You just put it on there not to put it on your eyes so you don't get in trouble if you do dumb things. Um, but overall, yeah, I would recommend this one. I like it a lot. Um, have you guys tried this one? If so, what did you think of it? And do you have any questions, comments, or opinions? Let me know down in the comment section. I love discussing things with you guys. Otherwise, don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye.